good Big Ten win? We were really high air tonight. Our passing was, after the first game, got really good. And it was a very good serving team. And we, uh, we caused them not to ace us and have 14 errors. And, uh, but I thought we were really just up and down with our play tonight. But we found a way to survive. After we lost game one, we found a way to come back and put some pressure on them. And uh, I thought our serving was pretty good and stressed them. And then um, you know, game four, we went back to high air again. So it was like this you know, all night, it felt like. Was that up and down a result of what was going on on your side of the net or what Michigan was doing? Uh, well, Michigan's a very good team, uh, but a lot of it, we just were not in a great rhythm tonight. And I don't know why, because we hit great last night, and we just were not in a great rhythm tonight. With uh, with Allison Jacobs, what do you what do you just respect about her, and what do you wish you would have done a better job on defending her? Well, uh, you know, she hits from everywhere. She does a really nice job. She's blowing it off our block. You know, and again, it just is so frustrating because we're we're in discipline. We're pulling our hands, and uh, but you know. For her size and what she does, she what, how many blocks does she have tonight? Uh, you know, she had a stuff on Andy and two other block assists. So I mean, she had you know three of their seven blocks or close to it. So um, you know, she's just a really good player. For some reason, she doesn't serve. So I don't know what the deal is on that, but um, but she carries a big load for them. Of your 27 hitting errors, 20 were unforced, not on blocks. I mean, what? I know. What was that? What was what was going wrong there? I don't know. It's just, I don't know. They just were, and they they were some bad hitting errors. You know, like way out. So I don't know. We just, I don't know. If it was our focus, or we just we weren't in a r- really got a great rhythm all night. Kennedy. Uh... Kennedy had a serving run in the four set that kind of got you back into it. What uh, what can be good when she's serving back there? Well, she I mean she had you know Ohio State. I think she had a couple aces last night. She had a couple runs, um, and you know and she plays really good defense. So, um, but yeah, she, she she we got number nine down the line there in that run. So she did a really nice job on that and. Uh, um, but she also brings great energy when she comes in. Now, you know, Lindsay came in, took another couple big swings coming off the bench. I mean, that's not easy to do, but, you know, she brings another. We just, I felt like we were just, we had no energy out there, and, and uh, I just felt like the crowd got fired up when she came in. She brought energy, and, and you know, that really, you know, we would run four or five points right there to win that thing. So that's so why we call them game changers. Start the second set. It seemed both Harper and Merritt had five zero runs with a couple aces, and did that kind of flip the switch to being more aggressive on the service line? That that shake off that first set. Well, we were we were, I mean, um, I, mean I thought we served really well all night. So uh, and that's where we got we did get some aces, and Merritt had it going, and then uh, and then even you know Merritt missed after that timeout in game four, but then she came back and thumped a couple other really good ones and got them in trouble. So. Uh, I thought our our um, you know our serving created some problems for them, but I, I thought everybody was. I mean, Livy. I don't know how many balls she served tonight. We ran a ton of points in her rotation. I actually we started game two with her serving. So I think that's what we did um, because she was. We were just running points in that ro- with her serving, and she was she played phenomenal tonight. Lexi played great tonight. Laney came in, made some big plays, had a great set that was a huge point for us. So um, those guys, those guys did a nice job tonight. Olivia tied a career high with ten digs tonight, just been holding down passing. Where have you seen her grow so far this year, and how much farther can she go before this year? Well, she's already putting up huge numbers passing. She's we're running a ton of points with her serving, but. She she made a lot of great digs back there. There's a lot of balls coming off the block and high that she dug, and took them with her hands. And and you know she's and, and nothing really. I mean she's you know really nothing really phases her. So it's she's a huge 
huge asset for us. She passed the jump serve tonight. Just and uh, like I said, she, you know, her and Lexi and Laney and Harper tonight. I mean, that's what when Michigan they're looking. You know, no aces and 14 errors. I mean, they, they haven't done that all year. Their ace to error ratio, if you look at it, is almost 50-50 on the, in the Big Ten. Okay. All right, guys.